We will start with overview of aircraft catering requirement. We will look at how catering works. We will look at how catering truck works and what are its major components. In order to understand the catering requirement of an aircraft, let's look at some rough numbers. Narrow body aircrafts carrying 200 passengers on a 7 hour flight would have to be served at least one meal to each passenger and a few extra meal packages are also kept. That means an aircraft like an Airbus A320 will carry more than 200 meals on board. Wide body aircrafts like a Boeing 777 carrying more than 300 passengers on long haul flights would need two meals per person. That makes it over 600 meals on a flight. Similarly, code F aircraft like an Airbus A380 carrying 500 passengers on a long haul flight will have to keep more than a thousand meals on board. Let's look at how aircraft catering works. Meals are not prepared during the flight. They are prepared on a remote location called a flight kitchen, which is a place for mass scale meal preparation. Flight kitchen will either be at an airport or in close proximity of an airport. Generally, every airline has its own flight kitchen where staff is working in shifts 24 seven preparing meals for the airline. A catering truck receives meals from the flight kitchen and carries it to the aircraft for replenishment. It is a common practice among airlines to return the meal packages that haven't been consumed in the flight, so catering for the next flight is always a must, and a catering truck is always busy carrying meals between the flight kitchen and the aircraft. Now the method used for transportation of meals is by using meal trolleys. These are the trolleys that you see flight attendants bring with them and serve passengers one by one. It is an easy and efficient way of serving meals inside the aircraft. In aircraft catering, it is not that individual meal packages as served to the passengers on board are replenished by the catering truck. What happens is that complete meal trolleys are replaced with new trolleys loaded with freshly prepared meals from flight kitchen. The meal trolleys that have already been emptied are loaded into the same catering truck and delivered back to the flight kitchen for cleaning, washing, servicing to make them ready for the next flight. This method saves time as compared to if meal packages are replaced in an aircraft because this method reduces the number of units being handled by airline staff. Now don't take catering truck just as a delivery truck. There is more to a catering truck than what meets the eye. It is a specialized vehicle that not only carries the catering supplies between flight kitchen and the aircraft, but it is also fitted with mechanisms to reach the aircraft door height so that a separate truck or separate machine is not needed for servicing the aircraft. Coming towards catering truck design, like many other mobile ground support equipment, a catering truck has a truck chassis over which all components are installed. Over the truck chassis is the characteristic part of a catering truck, the container which is used for a storage of meal trolleys. Catering trucks designed for servicing wide-body aircrafts have a larger container than a catering truck designed for servicing a narrow-body aircraft. The container is installed over a scissor lift that can raise the container to the same height as the aircraft door. Different models of catering trucks have different service heights that decide their compatibility with different aircraft types. Catering trucks used for narrow body aircrafts have a shorter service height than catering trucks designed for servicing a wide body aircraft like an Airbus A380. The container is fitted with a cabin, 
at its front that gives working space to the staff during loading and unloading of meal trolleys. Cabin has an extendable platform in front of it that serves as a bridge between the truck and the aircraft. Guardrails are also provided for safety of the staff traveling back and forth between aircraft and the container. A canopy is also provided in some models for weather protection so that rain or snow does not affect catering operation. The truck is fitted with hydraulic stabilizers that are engaged to ensure that the whole structure is not swaying when a staff is doing its job or during high wind speed on apron. Electric or hydraulic motors are available to allow the container to move towards or away from the aircraft to allow fine-tuned adjustment with the aircraft door. Another motor is also installed in the cabin assembly. This motor allows the cabin to adjust itself left and right with respect to the container to adjust itself with the aircraft door.